Now, all is not well in the last paradise on earth, and it so appears that President Mohammed Moizu's honeymoon period has come to an end. The Maldives Police Service, or the MPS, is probing allegations of trying to stage a coup against the Maldivian Democratic Party. Now, in the island nation's principal opposition, the development comes after a pivotal decision taken by the Bank of Maldives on Sunday. It suspended foreign transactions allowances on debit and credit cards related to Maldivian rufia accounts. In addition, the bank reportedly brought down the monthly foreign transactions limit for existing standard and gold credit cards to US dollar 100. It is the timing of the move that has triggered the investigation. Interestingly, the bank announced its decision while the opposition party was addressing a press conference on the government's financial situation. The country's police suspect foul play and they are terming it as a ploy hatched by the opposition party and the bank to overthrow the Muizu government. According to the cops, the opposition MDP tried to overthrow the government while the BML's board of directors made the decision on Saturday and announced it publicly on Sunday. The cops have also alleged that hundreds of quote-unquote bot accounts were active on social media shortly after the bank's announcement. These bot accounts called on residents to take to the streets to overthrow the government. However, after facing pressure from the Maldives Monetary Authority, the BML was forced to reverse its decision. In a statement issued on Sunday, the bank said changes to card limits for foreign transactions announced on 25th of August this year have been reversed based on instruction from our regulator, the Maldives Monetary Authority. The abrupt change in policy had sparked widespread concerns, including a rise in the black market rate for the dollar. This, apart from increased fears of inflation and economic instability, Maldives Republic reported. Analysts and opposition leaders had slammed the decision and warned of severe economic repercussions and disruption to essential international payments. International credit rating agency Fitch downgraded the Maldives in June. It warned that the island nation could be headed for a sovereign default after its foreign currency reserves dropped to $492 million in May. The downgrade came weeks after the IMF warned the Maldives against a looming debt distress as the small but strategically placed country eyes further borrowing from main creditor China. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.